In the presidential race today, John McCain continued to hammer Barack Obama with a new TV ad focusing on his association with a 1960s radical. Here's tonight's CBS News Campaign 08 Notebook. When convenient, he worked with terrorist Bill Ayers. When discovered, he lied. Bill Obama Ayers founded the terrorist ambition. group known as the Weather Underground. Years later, Obama worked with him in two nonprofit organizations, but insists they were never close and that the McCain camp is trying to, in Obama's words, score cheap political points by exaggerating his ties to Ayers. Senator McCain's campaign actually said, and I quote, if we keep talking about the economy, we're going to lose. So in the last couple of days, we've seen a barrage of nasty insinuations and attacks. On the campaign trail, Senator Obama today proposed extending a tax break to small businesses. Senator McCain called for suspending the requirement that you begin liquidating your retirement account when you turn 70 and a half. That rule is forcing many retirees to sell stock in the middle of this downturn. Bob Schieffer is our chief Washington correspondent and anchor of Face the Nation. Bob, on the campaign trail today, John McCain took a question from a man who told him that he's afraid of an Obama presidency. I'd like you and our viewers to hear how John McCain responded. I want to be president of the United States, and obviously I do not want Senator Obama to be. But I have to tell you, I have to tell you, he is a decent person and a person that you do not have to be scared as president of the United States. Now, I, I just, now I just, now, now look, I, I, if I didn't think I wouldn't be one heck of a lot better president, I wouldn't be running, okay? Bob, is that John McCain drawing the line after all the attacks he made on Senator Obama this week? Well, I think you have to say that now even John McCain may have concluded that this nastiness that has gripped this campaign for the last week or so, uh, it, that it has to stop. What McCain and his running mate Sarah Palin have been trying to do ever since this economic crisis uh, landed on all of us is, is to change the subject because once this economic news turned bad, Barack Obama started going up in the polls. Uh, McCain and his running mate have been trying to make this a referendum about Obama and his character instead of a referendum on the financial situation. Uh, the trouble is it does not seem to be working, Maggie. Uh, John McCain didn't have much of a week this week, a better week than the stock market probably, but not a very good week. That's not saying much, Bob. It's Friday, so I have to ask, who are your guests on Face the Nation this week? Well, we've got a big group. We've got, uh, among others, the uh, governor of uh, Colorado, Bill Ritter. That's one of the big swing states. And then John McCain's main man in the Senate, uh, Republican Lindsey Graham. He's not from a swing state, but uh, he can see one from his house. Really. <laughs> well, that counts, I think. Thank you, Bob.